Religion has been part of man since the beginning of human history as humans have always looked up to or revered a supreme being, patterning their ways of life after the moral principles dictated by the adherents. The same can be said of morality since the principles of right and wrong have guided many human societies for centuries. Nigeria can be termed a religious nation since her population is composed mainly of nominal Christians in the southern parts, numbering into millions, with a few in the north, as well as Islam predominating in the northern part, with a few people adherents of the African traditional religions. But do religion have an influence over the morality of Nigerians? Has it really affected their perception of right or wrong? Some Nigerians who answered these questions told the news crew that most religions in Nigeria have sound moral principles, but they have not really had a great influence on the morality of Nigerians to a large extent. By all standards, the word religion has to do with your belief in a particular identity that you need to conform to. That is to say that if, for instance, you are a Christian, your life is supposed to be Christ-like. And if you understand exactly what Jesus came to do, is that he came to bring, you know, humanity into sanity. That is to say that if you are born again by the good news that we have received from the Lord Jesus Christ, automatically you have been influenced to turn from your wrong ways into the right world. Religion, in the right perspective, if it is well communicated, it's supposed to influence the people. To begin to live right and do right. Well, Nigeria, you know, we, 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 we are built up of different, you know, intertribes and communities and all whatnot. And you understand that this thing has to do with an individual. You know, there are some that believe, there are some that does not believe. So if you are influenced, that's to say you have changed. You believe the, you know, the content and the message that will be given to you. So automatically, that's why you see, there are times you see the right people and you see some people doing the wrong things. In church, they preach different kind of uh, uh, different kind of moral upbringings but then you see the life we are living religion does not finish it okay. because some people will say if one does not commit certain sins will not meet up in life so to a large extent religion can but to another extent no other citizens who spoke with the news correspondent opined that though religious teach moral principles to their followers, the people allow their selfish nature to get the best of them and choose their ways of behaviors, thereby causing many vices in the present society. I feel people choose you know, the aspect of the scripture to obey and the aspect of the scripture not to obey because uh, the word of God is complete. And uh, if we really, f if we are really following what is written in the scripture, what God asks us to do, we are actually doing it. I don't believe all the ease that is happening in the society today will be very obvious. As at now, the pastors or the clergymen, they are trying their best as far as this morality issue is concerned. You know, the public, the public as it is. They have, they, they, no, nobody can just curtail them. Nobody can curtail them. They want to do anything they like to do. If you look at Nanda, all the event centers, for instance, if you go there, say, you know, you, know, you, you will even uh, wonder for yourself what is the country is, is, is looking like. Before it comes to religion, we were all were born into different religions. And in religion aspects, no, no religion, but pagan, Christian, Muslim. If you go there into their book of law, what is happening today? None of those things is written into those books. What I find out is from our selfishness, wickedness, as a woman. Because if as a woman, that God created you, that you have the heart of God, most of the things that is happening today will not be happening. Many people suggest that most Nigerians, though religious, should start practicing morality as taught in their religions because it contributes to a better society. Rebecca Goffey, reporting for BTV News.